Welcome, welcome back to a different opinion again. Usually only do one video a day, but as soon as I seen this, I literally had to do another video. It's, yeah, it's pretty wild. I've seen a video of it on Twitter. Yeah, quite hilarious. And in the future as well, if you do like my videos, please leave a like. Um, it just makes you see my videos in the future as well. Um, subscribe if you do want to see future videos. It'll pop up. And then also comment your thoughts. Um, if you agree or disagree, that's what makes it good is, you know, not everyone has to agree with each other and we can respect that. Um, so I'll jump straight into it. This one here is from the New York Post. Um, so it was last year, 2021. White influencer identifies as Korean after surgeries to look like a, you know, Korean boy band singer. A British-born white influencer has had 18 plastic surgery procedures to look like a member of a K-pop band, BTS and now identifies as Korean. I mean, this is the way the world is going, isn't it? They People can just think that they can change races. They just think, oh, do you know what? I like, you know, the Korean culture. Now I'm Korean. It's like, no, like, you know, you have to earn that right to be called Korean. You know, you got to go live in the country. You got to learn the culture. You got to put time and effort in. You can't just say, I'm just going to be Korean now. And I'm going to get some surgeries and I'm going to learn the language and that's it. So Ollie London, who uses they and them pronouns on Monday, shared the series of videos, blah, blah, blah. Show his latest work that he got done. Hey guys, I'm finally Korean. I just, yeah, I'd love to see what Korean people say about this. Um, hey guys, I'm finally Korean. I've transitioned um, in one transition in one video saying they were transracial and now identifies as Jimin. You can't do that, man. Like, this is why people don't like white people. It's because of people like this. This is the reason why. <laughs> oh, my Lord. I identify as Korean. That's just my culture. That's my home country. That's exactly how I look now. The newly laid. I'm not going to say it. Um, I'm so, so happy I've completed my look. I have the eyes and I've just had a bro lift as well, said the influencer. You do not look Korean. This person does not look Korean at all. Like, not at all. I've been trapped in the wrong body, but your body hasn't changed. You've just tried to do surgeries to be racist by trying to make your eyes smaller. Ah, oh, this is ridiculous. Like, this this is insane. But funny, yeah. I can be myself, and I'm so, so happy. For the first time in my life, I feel beautiful. They said of the 18 surgeries that cost more than 150 grand. Like, who's paying for this? I've transitioned. I've transitioned to a non-binary person. They, them, Korean, Jim. You can't. Oh, my lord. Showing off new Ollie saw. If you didn't know who I was, you'd just think I was. If you didn't know who I was, you'd just think I was a Korean person. Asking people to respect my decision after they've been bullied for my love of Jimin. I just love how he says, you know, you got to respect my decision. So imagine like in a Korean person being like, what? Why do I have to respect you trying to be like me by getting surgeries? And yeah, no. 18 surgeries in eight years. That is just. A whole nother like level of commitment to be a different race. You just think you'd move to like, you know, if you really wanted to be Korean, you'd actually move to Korea, put that 150 grand living there, learning everything, you know, be becoming a part of the community over there and actually earning the right to call yourself Korean. You can't just buy your right to be Korean, especially not this way. You know, especially not by just doing surgeries and being fully racist and saying I'm Korean now. That's just because you got surgeries. But anyone who has followed my journey for the last eight years know I've really struggled with identity issues with who I am and probably mental issues as well. While they got some support online, albeit some seemingly sarcastic, the announcement sparked plenty of outrage. This is actually unbelievable, degrading to Koreans. Like me, if he asserts that simply getting surgery to make his eyes more slanted makes him Korean. Hang Min Lee tweeted, Well put. Korean isn't a pronoun, nor is it a persona you decide to suddenly take on because of K-pop hype. Another Korean commentator said, I can't comment, commend you for taking a whole ethnicity and treating it like a persona. Thank you. There's some normal people in the world. See, like probably every Korean is thinking this, like this person is insane. Others were especially angered when they reimagined the South Korean flag to include pride rainbow colors. Playing with a flag from another country, man, that is serious. Every flag has a history about it, and he has the audacity to change it. 
one person tweeted, while others said it was actually a criminal offense in the country now identifies with. Does not look Korean. Look at this picture and tell me this person looks Korean. No, they don't. But yeah, like the, that's in one of the, you know, my other videos as well about the, the Dresa Goya player who didn't want to wear the, the number on the back. You know, every country has different laws. Just because in America you can do whatever you want to the flag, people like burn it, pee on it, you know, whatever they do of it, because they have that freedom through the constitution and all that. Like people don't like it, but you have the freedom to do that. That's what makes America great. You know, you do this in a country like this, in Korea, it's a crime. You do that in China, you're arrested and you'll probably never be seen again. So it's insane. I'll read the, so yeah, this is the person here. Um, I can't believe the series identifies as Korean. This is actually unbelievable, degrading to Koreans. When a human differences are effectively different brands, consumerism will be complete and humanity will be dead. The site makes it hard to like others and I'm starting to regret using it. <laughs> well put, he's not Korean. Absolute offensive, this is sickness. I'm absolutely in love with Asian culture. I've traveled to Korea, Japan, Taiwan, Singapore, China, Thailand, Hong Kong, and Laos. I live in an Asian family. I would never do this. It's degrading. It's enough to just appreciate the culture. Well put. Uh, and then yet again, you know, receives backlash. 31-year-old person having eye surgery, blah, blah, blah. So I just wanted to bring this to your attention. The reason why I do is because I was actually just watching this video on... Tim Pool's one. Tell me how you racially identify. I identify as Korean. I used to live in Korea. I was living there for one year. I love the culture. I love the history, the people. You know, I put myself through a lot of pain. I've had a lot of surgical. Yeah, his surgeries have healed. I don't know that it makes him look any more Korean. Certainly does not shout Korean when I'm looking at him, but we'll continue. See, just to have more She's of right. a Korean aesthetic. I spend a lot of time learning the language, learning how to cook Korean foods. I came out earlier this year, sharing that oh. with the world. People didn't really get it. <laughs> She's like, Oh, uh -huh. you came out, huh? Uh, As Korean, huh? Okay. It's even like yeah, cringe rewatching this away, again. But I hope over time, people will be kind of more accepting She's with me. Cringing. Transracial does not exist, and I think it is very, very harmful for us to push the narrative that it is possible to switch races. I was not happy the way I was. So I went to Korea and I had the most incredible experience of my life. It changed me, gave me happiness, and people have no right to take that happiness away from me. I. Oh, wow. Hilarious. Um, yeah, this is why people don't like white people. This person is actually, I believe, in my opinion, is actually a racist for, for just thinking that's what race is, right? Just by getting surgery, now you're a different race. It's insane. But I digress. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do you think this person is insane? What do you think? Do you think if you just get surgeries, you can, you know, will, do you, th actually, do you think It'll be a normal thing one day that people are just going to switch races and things like that all the time, like they do with genders. Um, please like the video if you did like it, and subscribe to see future videos as well. Thanks for watching.